all right good morning you guys today is sunday let me straighten up this okay and yes new hair y'all know ponytail queen anyway we go home today oh you know how i was complaining about this hotel so we are never staying here again we are next to a parking garage which when it gets late at night I don't know if people go in there just to do donuts or whatever noise all night long so disturbing and yeah it was horrible and I showed you guys the room yes I'm being bougie but I'm never staying here again it's clean we haven't seen any critters or anything like that so it is clean it doesn't have a good feeling about it and yeah when I was leaving Edna's in Melissa's hotel I'm like what in the world was I thinking just to I thought I saved 50 bucks but when I did the math and the calculations why is it blurry I did the calculations last night and I actually saved $70 that would have been $70 well spent to stay at the hotel they were at yeah so anyway we are packing up we are about to leave check out time is 11 o'clock it's 9 we were going to go to downtown Disney again because we actually didn't get a chance to go to Micheline's confectionery um, Marsha <laughs> yeah the Michelin man confectionery <laughs> we didn't get a chance to go there because the wait was so long and we did get on the wait list but we did it at 1130 after we got out of um, the Disney store and we waited an hour and a half and we were like we just need to go so I walked up to the lady and I asked her I said where am I on the list and she said there's 30 parties ahead of us 30 parties not 30 people 30 parties because one party could have I don't know 12 people I'm just saying so we just took our name off the list and left so we were gonna go there but since Edna actually went to Hollywood we went to Hollywood also. I'm just rambling, I know. Last month we went to Hollywood and a lot of things were closed. <laughs> People keep walking by the window, we're like, we went to Hollywood and a lot of things were closed. But when Edna went there, more things were open and they did a Hollywood tour that we actually want to go on. So instead of going back to downtown Disney today to get into Michelin's confectionaries, <laughs> we're going to go to Hollywood to leave this raggedy hotel that I am not going to be staying in again. It is ghetto. Your hotel is trash. <laughs> but yeah, I'm never, never again. Never again, you guys. So we have been stuck on the freeway. It's a parking lot and we're not moving. I don't know if you guys can see the flashing lights right there. Something is going on over there that's not even on the freeway. And then there's something over there and the bus RV, but there's policemen also over there. And okay, we're moving. been home for a while it's about 11 o'clock but we've been home for a while talking to Cheyenne playing with Boston just telling her about our weekend showing her pictures but I'm super tired and I am going to shower and go to bed thank you guys so so much for watching thank you for coming along with us on this journey to meet Edna and hang out with Melissa good morning it is Monday I am off work today I don't know if I told you guys that but I'm in Hobby Lobby I'm getting decorations for fall for my living room 
here's a little sneak peek I can't wait to put it all together I'm so excited you guys I love Hobby Lobby you guys so everything I got was 40% off the marked price so I got a lot of things but I did not spend a lot of money in addition to that I was able to use my coupon because you can go on HobbyLobby.com and you get a 40% off coupon for one item so and they use that for the most expensive items so I did that and I'm gonna go decorate my house for fall at first I said I was going to wait until October 1st but October is this week so close enough so I got five bags of things I cannot wait to decorate I know it looks like a lot of stuff but everything here under $70 I love Hobby Lobby so much so I'm about to eat lunch so Savannah has been loving these Beyond Meat Famous Star um, because she's trying to do the whole vegan thing and I decided to try one today so that's how it looks and I'm definitely gonna take off the onions tomatoes and lettuce cuz I'm basic when it comes to my burgers okay so I just tried the Beyond Meat burger. For those of you that don't know, Beyond Meat is completely vegan. Um, it's made up of pea protein isolates, rice protein, mung bean protein, canola oil, coconut oil, potato starch, apple extract, sunfire lechon, and pomegranate powder. So it's actually pretty good it's flavored very well I don't know if I will eat something like this all the time but it's good can't complain okay so this is my little setup right now which is just something simple for day-to-day -day living and then I have that up there I'm gonna change all that as well well maybe not the whole thing we'll see and over here I'm going to put out some fall stuff as well okay so here is my kitchen nook table no one really sits here so I know there's a lot going on and I actually probably should move some of this stuff right now actually I think I will okay this is much better after I turned on the camera it's like mm, this is a little bit much on this table I brought out my table runner that I used to have in the living room and I kept it in the living room for years just because it matched and if y'all remember I bought this last year this setup right here I got it all at Dollar Tree and I actually had it on my living room table last year and even though it's cute for a kitchen area or whatever not so much for the living room so that's the reason why I decided to get new things for the living room so yeah all right you guys just want to reveal to you my setup like I said, everything I got at Hobby Lobby, thankful and blessed sign, and the garland, and I just bought some fairy lights, that's what I always call them, and I put it in there. Then I have this right here, and then I got like a bag of acorns and pine cones, and I just put it along here. Right here is a pumpkin spice candle that I'm going to burn, not right now though. And on my table, it's more fancy than last year in here. So I bought the charger and it's really cute, you guys. Look how it has the leaves on it and it's orange. Definitely fall and festive. And I just decorated the charger plate right there. Put some more pine cones and the acorn, acorns, acorns over there. You guys know I can't talk. So I bought the mug also at Hobby Lobby. And I also bought the decorations that's in there just to make like an arrangement. But yeah, you guys, what do you think? I think it's super cute. And this ribbon right here, I thought I had the wire on the ends because I was gonna gather it and have it, you know, just bunched up like that here and there, but it didn't. Um, not too upset. Maybe I'll put another piece and have it double so it can be a little bit thicker. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. But yeah, what do you guys think? I think I may actually put the sign behind there. That way you can see the garland more and ignore this. <laughs> when you're sitting down, you won't be able to see this. This is actually the antenna for the TV in case we want to watch regular TV and not Netflix or anything like that. So 
yeah right there and then here you guys I think it's super cute see everything I wish you guys could smell this candle it smells so good I cannot wait to burn that and then like I said this I just bought these separately see and I just like twisted them together yeah just gonna set that right there all right you guys what do you think all right I changed it up a little bit you guys I think this is much better it was over there and I moved it to the center and I took the antenna and actually put it behind there um, we don't watch regular TV that much I'm just going to leave that there for now and yeah it's super cute until I move everything for when I decorate for Christmas but at least this can be up through October and November so yeah oh I said I was gonna put another piece here let me try and see how it'll look okay definitely much better now that I cut another piece to make it a little bit thicker that's so cute you guys I love it so cute yay I'm so happy now I have all this extra I can use if I ever need it so I'll just keep it in here with my other ones check out my view from my chair super cute feels so cozy in here